Hello everyone. I am Sharanesh Kumar from Savik Technology. I am heading analytics practice here. We have participated in uh, hackathon conducted by SAP Co Innovation Lab in September 26th to 30th. Uh, I can proudly announce say that we are the winner. We got first place Savik Technology for our use case. We have submitted our use case of like intelligent inventory and material planning. Then we will step into our use case. Yes, uh, coming to our use case, intelligent inventory and material planning, SAVIC built enterprise planning, composable analytics, pre built business content with SAP Analytical Cloud by using BTP as a platform. We build this use case. See, uh, uh, as a high level uh, uh, use case details will be if we talk about our uh, SAVIC built use case, we have built multi dimensional inventory vision. See, in present scenario, any uh, manufacturing industry, uh, CPG industry, if we can take, the uh, management doesn't have 360 degree more, uh, stock overview, it will not be available for them to analyze the things and they can uh, guide to their team. Right? See, they, this is out of stock situation will not be identified by the top management or decision making authority. And it is not, not possible to plan situation of any marketing and sales person to to get into that inventory part right yeah next comes to like yes we said in earlier as a composable analytics we are connecting multiple data sources right sap erp uh, dealer inventory plus e-commerce platform you can say uh, amazon ebay uh, the, the, these are all the few examples we are giving here we are connecting all the data sources and we are bringing the data into like data lay in a SAP BTP platform, this business warehouse cloud from there, we'll be bringing different actionable, you can see here like uh, in SAP analytical cloud and forecasting and predictive plan. As you said earlier uh, slides, BTP components we used in this use case is data warehouse cloud, ANA cloud, cloud integration, like platform integration part plus business application studio, ANA studio. Finally, SAP analytical cloud for predictive and forecast planning. These are the major components you used. If it comes to uh, what are all the uh, solution actionable items uh, from this use case, you can see these are all the real time actionable uh, live action on out of stock scenario. We, as you said, we different uh, data sources and locations. We have to identify which are which product or which SQ is going, going out of stock. We have to take action on that and minimize the lead time. Ultimately, this is the concern for everyone. We need to bring down the lead time like to customer it should reach within uh, like their expected time or early to that. Managing the level of stock in the different uh, uh, storage locations, it is a major criti critical area so that we can save the money and we can bring the performance also. So automating the sales, finally avoiding unnecessary spending, improving customer satisfaction. These are all the solution from this dashboard. You can see uh, this is our high level architecture uh, we, we build in SAP by using SAP B2P, uh, intelligent inventory and material planning. Right side, you can see we are connecting on premise or S SAP S4 on a uh, system and dealer management system, third party integration like e commerce and uh, dynamic market research like all the e commerce platform, Amazon, Web, eBay, Flipkart, everything. We are all the data we are bringing into data various cloud. From there, we are will be it will be connected to. Like finally, it will be connected to SAP Analytical Cloud data modeling part and we'll do here. Then, if you see uh, left side, you can see user and decision making authorities can be seen this analytics part insights uh, like, uh, the, by SAP Analytical Cloud uh, capabilities. We can forecast the things and the predictive planning can be done here. 